Hey guys, this is Shantanu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I am going to share you how to create sitemap for your blog using Rank Math SEO plugin. A sitemap is a very very important file for your website because sitemaps are generally used by search engines like Google, Bing, uh, DuckDuckGo. So like as a user, we generally understand uh, a website visually. In a similar way, if your like search engine needs to understand your website technically, they will read your sitemap plugin. Sorry, sitemap file actually. So you must create an XML sitemap. So with the use of Rank Math SEO plugin, you can create a sitemap for your website very very easily. Before installing Rank Math. I used to use Yoast SEO plugin. I was creating a sitemap using Yoast SEO plugin. Uh, for few of my site, I was also using uh, like Google XML sitemap generator uh, plugin is there. So after installing Rank Math, that I have removed all the all the other like sitemap plugins. You don't need actually because using Rank Math you can create a very clean sitemap file for your website. So how to do that? Let's proceed to the tutorial. Okay, so. I have installed Rank Math already. So this is the dashboard uh, you can uh, see. If you're installing Rank Math for the first time, uh, so let me, uh, how it will uh, look like to you. So, so let me run the setup wizard again. Okay. So if you're installing Rank Math for the first time, you will be going through these screens first. Getting started, then your site, search console. Then the third one will be your sitemap tab. For the complete, step-by-step -step tutorial you can check the video description where i have shared my uh, rank math seo settings article from directly from my blog post so that uh, i have created that article with a lot of images step-by-step -step guide you will you will be able to easily follow that guide to set up rank math plugin okay so during the setup process you will come across this part where you have to click this option on sitemap on then whether you want to include your images part of your sitemap yes we want then what are the other like post types so post and pages so i'm allowing only post and pages so that like search engines should crawl only post page and then images to and they should rank them categories and tags you can or you uh, if you want doesn't want you don't don't uh, like allow them in the sitemap but right now for i only kept the categories so anyway let's go back so as soon as you are done with the installation of uh, rank math in the left hand side you can see that sitemap settings so as we have enabled sitemap file using rank math so it will give you a url like this so let me click on it so this is the one we are getting right now so this is the post and this is the page so if you click on the post sitemap you will find all the articles of my website so there are three articles or you can say 83 post including this blog also it is counting and you can see number of images so these are this is the entire like list of articles of my website you can track from this sitemap file now using rank math you can go for further details to set up your xml sitemap file so you can see in the left side there are posts so you can do like post level settings page level settings media level settings i am using thrive products so thrive symbols thrive light boxes categories including side map tags symbol so lot of detail options so rank math is really a good plugin which will provide you lot more options to create a sitemap so if you have not yet created sitemap for your blog so I will recommend you to install Rank Math and then set up this sitemap plugin. If you're not at all using Rank Math, you're using Yoast SEO plugin, your, your Yoast SEO plugin will also generate a similar sitemap file. If it doesn't like the URL, you need something like sitemap.xml, then you have to install 
your that google xml sitemap generator but whatever it is make sure you should have only one sitemap generator plugin if you are using google xml then disable the either eost seo plugin sitemap or rank math sitemap plugin but it is better to use only one plugin because this more number of plugins will reduce your will increase your website loading time so uh, hope uh, uh, by following this tutorial you will be easily able to set up your uh, sitemap file if you like this video you can like hit the thumbs button you can share your feedback by writing a simple comment below if you have more questions related to sitemap or anything related to wordpress you can uh, do let me know through uh, your comment for more such useful videos and tutorials uh, please subscribe to my youtube channel Thank you for watching.